Greetings everyone! In today's video I'm going to cover all the badges and locations and how to get them in Military Simulator. And you are probably asking, where the f*** is the militia guide? Well, I'm a red guard now and red guards can't be in militia and that means I don't have access to a handbook so it's kinda hard receiving info so it will be delayed. And this is old footage so yes. I am Alicia in this video, but not at the time. And if there's a specific batch you want, there are time marks down in the description, so you can use them if you want. But let's get to the video. The first batch is thank you for playing, and you get it for joining the game. You should be able to get it, it's it's not that hard. Next one is Premier's share. You will get this for sitting in this share, which is in the board of directors spawn. Now, the door requires a Cleanse 4 card, so if you don't have Border Director, the bo if you don't have a Border Director Game Pass or the Cleanse 4 Game Pass, it's kind of hard getting there. If you meet a nice Border Director, he or she might let you in there to get that game badge. Or you do it my way, the creepy way. Get it? Because I, I like have Creeper in my... <coughs> <coughs> sorry, sorry about that. It seems that X card the master of puns has been at my computer. Well, no more puns for him. Where was he? Uh, oh yes, uh, the creepy way is when you just stand outside the room until the board director joins or needs to respawn, and then you just rush door and sit in the chair like a boss. <laughs> the next game badge is located here. This door requires a cleanse free card. So if you don't have one, the creepy way does not work unless you see someone with it and you ask them to open it for you. This badge is the officer's complex. So you just need to jump down here and sit on the couch beside the cool kids room and you should get it. Now, the next one is a bit tricky, tree labs. Now, how you get this is you coming through the glass to the trees here. Yes, you, you get it for touching the trees. Now, if you don't have a stray helping your boy out, you can bug yourself in. How did I do? I just jumped in. I just tried to jump beside it, spammed shift lock and, and looked 90 degrees wrong and then you zoomed in and zoomed out from first to third person. Now I did that for like one minute and I just got it. So yes, this is a hard one but you can get it without using a stray. Also don't like kick stray or something, he he, he did it for the video and I don't, I don't see it as an, I don't see it as abusement if it was not against my will. So keep your hands away from him. <laughs> Now, the next one is a hard one to get. Now, you need to get behind these boxes down here. Now, if you know this path already, you know the tunnel right here, yeah. But most of you probably don't know that you can go down here and swim. Now, if you swim like this, you will end up here. Now, there's a door here with a cleanse 4 card. If you walk into there, you will get the badge. This is how it looks on the inside, if any of you know, are wondering. And if you're wondering, the other paths in the water system, they, those paths don't lead to anything. Now, the next one is very easy to get. And all the raiders have this badge. All of them. <laughs> train assault. Just like, just walk in the tunnel where the train went. Yeah, went. Every, everyone can do this easily, you just need to get a clean swan card from the inside and some good parkour skills from the outside. Now these were all the game badges at the border, so let's move on to the badges in the city. The first one is the hardest to get in the game, Tower Hideout. Now this is in the red tower right over the HQ border. Now you can't get this without using a jetpack or someone using jetpack for you. And Stray got one, so we were able to get up there. And this is me after being killed by ABDKW. <laughs> now, the other one is to rob the bank, and how, how do I say this? Um, I hope you get a server with just you in it, so you can like, 
Yes. <laughs> But you get it for robbing the bank in the city. City, not the palace. The next one... I have shown like before, but but this is the secret gun shop. You get this for entering the gun shop in the city, which is located here. And to all my lovely CPSU members, don't go there and buy a M4 to RK and and carry. Thanks. The price militia if you want to kill illegal people, not innocent. Now we will move on to all the game badges in the palace. Now the next one is welcome to the palace and uh, and no one is wondering how you get this but I will still say it. You you enter the palace and boom you get it. Now there are also a badge for robbing the bank in the palace. Try to do it in the server with only you in it. You, you can be punished for doing it on duty or off duty, so yes. <laughs> Don't ask how I got it, please. Now we'll show you how to get the the top of the world badge. Now, you will need a cleanse 4 card or be a creeper outside the mayor's office. Now, if you are in the mayor's office, you can jump through this painting right here and then climb up this ladder and then walk to the edges. And you should get it. And that was the last of them. Now, that was all the game badges currently in the game. So for being inactive for some time, I have become a senior politburo and a red guard while I have been gone. And Christmas times too. Thanks to official, the official, thank, <laughs> thanks to the, thanks to the official, thanks to the official stray for helping, thanks to the, Thanks to the official stray for showing me and helping me show everything. Boom. Very nice of him. And I could have forget. We reached 1000 subs. Yeah.